Liv Morgan has taken a dig at Rhea Ripley while she recovers from her injury. During a backstage brawl between the superstars, Ripley hurt her shoulder. Ripley's injury led to her relinquishing the Women's World Championship. Becky Lynch won the vacant title on Monday Night Raw before she lost it to Morgan at King and Queen of the Ring. Now, Morgan has taken a dig at Ripley while responding to a Twitter slash X user who posted a clip where Rhea assaulted Liv as she put her arm in a steel chair. The account asked the reigning women's world champion how her arm was now. She sent a seven-word message aimed at the eradicator, referencing her injury. Bill Apter believes Rhea Ripley will break away from the Judgment Day to team up with Damian Priest. Bill Apter believes Rhea Ripley will leave the Judgment Day and pair with Damian Priest upon her return to WWE programming. Speaking on Sports Kita Wrestling's Unscripted, Apter claimed that Priest would lose the World Heavyweight Championship to Seth Rollins at the Money in the Bank PLE. This could lead to Priest and Ripley breaking away from Judgment Day. What I think is going to happen is that she is going to pair with Damian Priest, who I think might lose the World Championship to Seth freaking Rollins at Money in the Bank, and then he is forced to break away from Judgment Day. And I think Rhea is going to come back, be all PO'd about the whole thing with Liv Morgan infiltrating the Judgment Day, and it's going to be she and Damian Priest as their own kind of separate entity then, feuding against Liv Morgan and Dominic Finn Balor. That's what I think is going to happen, Apter said. WWE is yet to reveal Rhea Ripley's return date. During her absence, Morgan has been involved in a storyline with Dominic Mysterio and the rest of Judgment Day. In the quiet solitude of the backstage area, amidst the bustling chaos of WWE's live event, Rhea Ripley found a rare moment to gather her thoughts. The smell of sweat and adrenaline hung thick in the air, a constant reminder of the high stakes and fierce competition that defined her world. She leaned against a cold metal locker, her mind still buzzing from the intensity of her match earlier that night. As she ran a hand through her tussled hair, trying to ease the tension in her muscles, she heard footsteps approaching. Rhea turned to see Liv Morgan, her fellow wrestler and sometimes rival, striding towards her with a determined look on her face. Liv's fiery red hair was tied back in a loose ponytail, and her ring gear clung to her athletic frame, a stark contrast to Rhea's more subdued demeanor. Hey, Rhea, Liv greeted, her voice carrying a hint of challenge. Rhea raised an eyebrow, curious about Liv's sudden appearance. Hey, Liv, what's up? Liv hesitated for a moment, as if choosing her words carefully. I heard what you said in that interview last week. Rhea frowned her memories struggling to catch up with the whirlwind of media obligations and backstage gossip. What interview? Liv crossed her arms, her expression growing more serious. The one where you mentioned me and that accident. Realization dawned on Rhea. A few months ago, during a particularly intense match, Liv Morgan had inadvertently injured Rhea with a misdone move. It was a moment of chaos in the ring, one that had left Rhea sidelined for weeks with a shoulder injury. Despite their professional rivalry, Rhea had never publicly blamed Liv for the incident, but the tension between them had been palpable ever since. I didn't mean to stir things up, Rhea replied, her voice calm but firm. It was just part of the storyline, you know how it is. Liv's expression softened slightly, but the challenge in her eyes remained. Maybe she conceded, but you can't deny that things have been different between us since then. Rhea sighed running a hand through her hair again. She couldn't deny the truth in Liv's words. The injury had strained their relationship, both inside and outside the ring. Trust was a fragile thing in their world, easily broken and hard to mend. Yeah, things have been tense, Rhea admitted, but that's just part of the game, Liv. We both know how it works. Liv nodded, her gaze steady. I get that, but sometimes things need to be said. Rhea studied Liv for a long moment, weighing her words. There was a raw honesty in Liv's voice that resonated with her, a reminder of the shared sacrifices and struggles they faced as professional wrestlers. Despite their differences, they were bound together by their passion for the sport. So, Liv continued, breaking the silence that had settled between them. What do you really think about what happened? 
Rhea took a deep breath, considering her response carefully. It sucked, she admitted finally. Getting injured is never easy, especially when it's because of something that could have been avoided.